Hi guys, it's Steph and in today's video we are at Taco Bell trying out a brand new item. I'm super excited because it's spicy. But it is called a steak white hot ranch fries burrito. So it's spicy. I've, I've been doing some research on it before I came here and apparently it's really spicy so I'm so excited because I love spicy. And also next month they're coming out with the Mexican pizza, which I tried that a few years back and I honestly don't think I liked it, but we will give it another try. We'll give it another try. But I mean, if I'm coming to Taco Bell, I want a taco, not a pizza. If I want a pizza, I could go somewhere else, like a pizza place. <laughs> but let me go get in line. Let me scoot up because my short legs can't reach. I literally am one of those people who sit an inch away from the steering wheel. But let me get in this line because now there's a line. There wasn't a line when I showed up. Let me read you guys what is in this burrito. So it is 500 calories and it has steak, white hot ranch sauce, nacho cheese, cheese, tomatoes, reduced fat sour cream, healthy, and some seasoned nacho fries, which those are brand new and back to because they keep teasing us. They bring them back and then they're like, yeah, you just get a little taste. You don't get the full action here. And they take them away. But I'm really, really hungry. Oh, wow, it's 2.30. How is it 2.30? I have not ate yet. I woke up at 7 in the morning. I went to bed at like 3 in the morning. I took Hershey into the vet. She's getting surgery today. She's getting her big girl six-month surgery. I'm getting spayed. And I feel so bad for her. The vet just texted me. She's like in the recovery room resting so I'll probably be able to go pick her up here soon. I am vlogging it over on my second channel but my poor Hershey I literally like handed her in outside because it's like curbside pickup. Oh gosh I'm gonna go over the curb. Okay I made it. <laughs> but I like handed her into the vet and I like walked away and I'm like oh my god I'm gonna cry. I kind of did cry a little bit because I feel bad. She was like shaking like so scared and I just had to like leave her. But she'll be good. She'll be good. And yeah, so I woke up so early and I was so tired. I was like driving and I'm like falling asleep. Her, she was even sleeping too in the car. I'll show you a picture. He was like, oh, you look so precious and I'm just turning you in to go get put to sleep for a surgery. Like, I feel so bad. Like, look at her sleeping all peacefully this morning. Like, so cute. But yeah, then I came home and I went back to sleep for a little bit and here we are so I am really really hungry and I think we're just gonna get the burrito I don't even see it up on the menu where is it I honestly don't even see it hi do you guys have the new steak white hot ranch fries burrito Okay, could I get one of those, please? And an order of cheesy Fiesta potatoes and a small iced Cinnabon Delight coffee. Right. And that'll be it. A small... What? All right. A small cinnamon delight, ice, coffee, and a piece of potatoes, and a white heart ranch burrito nacho fries steak. Yes. Gotcha. Total seven ninety seven. I'll see you in the drawing window. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Oh my gosh! It's so oh, I'm shivering. It's so cold. It is so so cold. It is almost May. What the hell, Ohio? What in the world? Seriously. <laughs> it's so cold. And it says this weekend is supposed to be 82. So that's great. I love this bipolar weather. Honestly, it is kind of fun though because it's like one day it's cold, one day it's hot. So fun. You get to wear winter clothes and summer clothes like all in the same week. Because I do love winter clothes like long sleeves and jeans. I prefer that over like shorts. I like jeans. But also, I'd rather wear, like, short sleeves and tank tops with jeans. So, like, right in that 
median of weather. I also got my hair done. Can you guys tell? I'm obsessed with it. I really like it. It's like perfect for summer. So I went in and just got my hair like touched up. I went to a new girl and oh my gosh, it was so much more affordable. I was getting ripped off. Hi. Take one for the White Hot Ranch and iced coffee. Yep. Seven ninety. Thank you. Seven bonds of light. And I'm pretty sure all these coffees are coming medium size. So. Oh, okay, that's fine. Thank you. <laughs> so yeah, I got my hair done and it was like $115. I got a small little trim. I was like, don't cut my hair off because whenever I ask for a trim, they always cut my hair off and I'm trying to grow it out. So I'm like, please do not cut too much off. Like I didn't even want a haircut. I'm like, leave some of the dead pieces. I don't care. Is that too bright of lighting? Yeah, I think so. So I was like, leave some of the dead pieces, but she did a great job and I love it. It turned out great. The last girl I got my hair done, I was leaving and it was 300 bucks and I was there for like an hour, no joke. So I really like how she did it and I just got like half a head of balayage. And since my hair was already kind of balayaged before, oh my gosh, I just did horrible parking. I'm in the middle of the line. So yeah, it's like half a head of highlights. But since my hair was already kind of blonde at the bottoms, it kind of looks like it's like ombre, but I really like it. I really like it. It's taco time! We got cheesy fiesta potatoes. You gotta shake them up like you shake up your chipotle bowl. It's quite little. This is actually quite little. Okay, it was $4, $3.89 to be exact, and it's kind of a little guy. But hey, you gotta give the little ones some love too sometimes. We'll try it. So it's not toasted. Just a plain white fella. <laughs> what am I on today? Seriously. <laughs> and then this Cinnabon Delight iced coffee is newer as well. It came out a few weeks ago. I've already had it before though, but I wanted to get it because... I wanted some coffee. I was gonna say, like, I don't seem like I need coffee, but I did wake up early, but then I went back to sleep, so. Okay, let's take a couple bites of this. I'm really excited. What size should we bite first? I think of this side. Oh, wow. Wow, that's saucy. I can, like, I got a big squirt of sour cream in my mouth. Mmm. It is like filled with sauce. The sour cream and then that spicy white sauce. It is spicy, wow. Like look at all of the sauces in there, you guys. Wow. I really, really like it. I was like, mm, it has steak in it. I'm like not too big of a fan of steak and burritos. I was gonna swap it out with like beef or chicken. But this sauce. This is most definitely the juiciest and sauciest burrito I've ever had from Taco Bell. Like, it's it's like actually the perfect size too. I was like, oh, it's so little, but it is really stuffed. And the fries in there, mmm. This is delicious. Wow, it is as it is spicy. It's not like I need to chug water spicy, but like my mouth is on fire, but I like it. Mmm. Well, I'm surprised Taco Bell. But yeah, it took the girl like probably two hours to do my hair and it was way cheaper than the last couple times I was getting my hair. Like, I don't know how it was 300 bucks when 
she just added like a little bit of blonde in it and there's already blonde in it before isn't that expensive and that's not even including the tip So 20% on a 300 tip is like, what, $60? Something like that. So it was expensive. I feel like it should not be that expensive, you know? It shouldn't. And especially including the tip. Like, I don't know if some... I feel like some services should just have the tip already included. Like what they choose their price to be I feel like it should be kind of already with the tip maybe and then like servers at restaurants that's different because you're like can I get a cup of ranch can I get straws can I get this and that and then they have to like go back and get it and get it but like when you get your hair it's just like one thing and then that's it I feel like when it's already $300 for something like simple it should kind of already have the tip included I don't know but when it was 115, I'm like, oh yeah, this is great. This is wonderful. It's kind of leaking juices at the bottom. And I'm squirting them out. So I hope to pick up Hershey here soon. She's been gone so long. It's been like so quiet in my home. And then You guys, I don't even know what my camera, like, when it stopped recording, but this thing is so annoying. I'm like, I should return it, but it's too late to do that. It overheats, and it stops recording, and the sunshine isn't even on my camera, so I don't know why it's, like, the internal temp is getting so hot. Like, my video was only, like, 15 minutes long. Like, it shouldn't stop recording like that. My other camera never did that. But I finished the burrito, and the bottom was really spicy. It had, like, a ton of juices down there, and I was just chugging my water. It was really hot. Mmm. Also, the vet just called. Hershey's ready to be picked up. So, after I eat this, I'm going to go get her. And, oh my gosh, I'm nervous to see her. I hope she's not all, like, like loopy and sad. I don't know if she'll still be loopy. I remember with Cookie, our family English Bulldog, when we brought her home, she was like really, really loopy for like the whole day. Mm. But I got HelloFresh today and I was like, I should just, I shouldn't get Taco Bell today. So then I'm like just at home and I have like more things to do. I could cook dinner and you know, do all that because I can't go to the gym probably tonight. I'll probably be with her all, all day. I was going to go to the gym this morning after I dropped her off, but I was too tired. Because I'm like, I'm not going to be able to go later. But I went last night, so. I don't know, maybe she'll be fine. I'll, I'll just have to see what they tell me, but she's going to be wearing a cone. <laughs> mm. But yeah, I ended up getting Taco Bell, but I have a few videos I need to edit, so I'll, I'll be editing for hours, and I might film like a Sims 3 or Sims 4 episode. Because you guys, usually when I mukbang or eat fast food, it has me full the entire day. Like, I probably won't be hungry at all the rest of the day. It's almost three. I'll probably just want, like, a snack at nighttime. But that's it. Like, it really fills me up. Like, if I was at home and I just ate, like, a breakfast, I'd get hungry in, like, two hours. But fast food, like, really fills me up. So even though it's, like, unhealthy, it's, like, but then I'd, I'm, like, not hungry the rest of the day. So it's, like, not really that unhealthy. I always convince myself that it's like not bad for you but like it's not like it's really not unless I ate like five of those burritos then yes it is even if I ate like three of them that's like a lot mmm those potatoes are so good let's have a sip of our coffee oh my gosh I'm so excited to see Hershey I hope she's okay. Well, thank the Lord. She is okay. Because, like, you always worry with, like, bulldogs and stuff getting put under because of their breathing. 
Um, and then like on the paperwork I had to sign, it was like, she could die, this and that. But it's like they say that with every surgery, like even with humans, they say like there could always be something that goes wrong. It's better today than the last time I had it. It's much more strong. I feel like the first time it was really, really sweet. Mmm. This tastes like cinnamon iced coffee. It is sweeter though, but much more strong today. Well, anyways, you guys, I am done eating. I'm going to go pick up Hershey. And yeah, that burrito was good. Like, that was really good. I would definitely want to get that white hot ranch again, just even on the side. It would be good, like, dipping a quesadilla in it, too. It's spicy. Let me know if you guys want me to try out the Mexican pizza again when it comes out next month. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.